And we all know I'm really into fine glass. And I'm here with Grant from Way Cool Industries. Grant's got some new glass. He's got uh, his camera glove. So Grant, what brings you to PIA 2007? Uh, PA 2007 was mainly come over here and network with you guys, show the product, talk to suppliers. Well, you got some cool products. This is a very nice piece of glass I'm holding in my hands here. It feels quite substantial and uh, it's very, very clean, I've noticed as I'm, I'm looking through it. So tell me a little, bit of, a little bit about this glass and why you designed this glass the way you did. This is, this is our black eye lens. It was designed from the ground up by Way Cool in Australia. It was made for the purpose of hand cam video the glove here. This is uh, pretty much all the rage in Australia, New Zealand, South Pacific, South Africa. This is how we shoot tandem video now down there. This lens here is uh, it's about as wide as you can get without cutting corners of the frame here. And uh, How wide is that? In other words, if, if, uh, if you were shooting me with the, the hand cam, I'm your tandem passenger, and you're shooting me, uh, about how much of my body are we going to pick up with that? Well, we'll have your head and down to your knee, sometimes the whole body depending on the angle, you know, because you're not shooting at, at the straight body here, you're shooting at an angle back like that. Sure. You can shoot from here, you can shoot from here, you can get a whole range of shots with this, you can come back from behind here and get a point of view shot. Okay. So, so you're shooting about a, it sounds like it's about a 0.25? Yeah, two, yeah. 0.25. Wonderful. And uh, it looks like it's got a nice uh, slim profile, so we're not going to have to worry about riser slap yeah, or anything well, else walking that, into it? Yeah, that was a critical part of the design. That, that, that it had to be real small and because hand cam's got its possible dangers, you know, and one of those is snagging, so we designed the lens to be really small. It also lightens the load on, on the, the lens on the front of the cameras. Great. So uh, tell me a little bit about your uh, hand cam glove there, your wrist glove. Well, this was... I first saw it in Australia when I was skydiving professionally in skydive cans. <laughs> Guy Brian there was making these and... One or two of them he was making, three or four, but he didn't want to do it. So I, I said to him, do you want, you cool with me commercially doing this? He said, yeah, so I've been doing this for about five years now, getting them all around the world. Wonderful. Well, it uh, looks like it's a little more comfortable than the glove that I've got. Plus, you've got a, a Cam I-2 set up on there. Yeah, yeah. this, so. this Cam I is actually an exclusive one. It's a hybrid version that works. It's a cross between a Sport and a, and a Cam I-2, and it's done for us for this particular purpose. Oh, wonderful. So uh, why should anybody buy your glove over somebody else's glove? We pioneered the gloves. We, we build the best gloves. That'll last two times as long as the camera inside it. <laughs> oh, I can't say it's, it's much more comfortable than mine. The, the glove that I've got, it kind of pinches right, right through here. It's not the soft neoprene like you've got there. Um, this is a much heavier duty neoprene. Plus, I see you've got um, a mount for your altimeter there, or rather a guide for your altimeter, so yeah. you know your you know your altimeter is going to stay right in that range there where you want it to yeah, be. Yeah, and we designed that so you can leave the LT on the glove. You just undo the zip; the whole thing stays together. You pick it up, go for a jump. Oh, well, that makes sense. You can leave the LT right on the glove, yeah. so you're not having to undo two things when you're in a rush between those hot loads. Yeah, man. And most of our other models, this one particularly doesn't have it, but most models have a, a piece of webbing here as well, so you can mount a uh, Neptune on there if you like. Okay, great. Now, I, I see a little a, a window here, but what about the microphone? Are we going to be able to have the microphone exposed so that you're doing those those pre-jump vids? Yeah, the microphone picks up through the, through the neoprene, so you can use it through the neoprene with the pre-jump vids, maybe leave the flap open at the top. Sounds uh, but good. But yeah, we pick up really good after opening stuff, you know, you real big screams and yahoos and you can put it right here and if, you know, you have an angle like this when you open so you get the customer's face and the canopy. Sniveling yeah, up above sniveling, you. Yeah, yeah. Wonderful. Well, uh, has Way Cool got anything else coming up here in the near future we should be known about? Or is it all top secret right now? Ah, uh, right now. We've got a few things on the, on the cards, but we'll keep that to ourselves for now. All right. Well, so thanks, for, thanks for taking a minute to talk with us here at PAA and uh, welcome to the States. Thanks, man. See you. Back to you.